Yo, we talking about when I met the legendary actor, activist, comedian, uh, nutritionist, nutritionalist, Dick Gregory, Baba Dick Gregory, uh, Richard Gregory. Rest in power to the man, the legend, the first black man to actually run for presidency in 1968. Uh, check his resume. I'm telling y'all. Look, when I lived in Virginia, they had a spot in Virginia Beach called, um, what was that spot called? A comedy spot. Funny Bone. And I actually um, seen, seen him twice. I met him the second time. The first time we went and we just um, listened to his lecture and it was amazing. It was off the chain. And then he came back uh, maybe about three or four months later. And that's when I actually stayed after to actually meet him, shake his hand, took a picture with him. I am going to put that picture up. It should be, uh, actually I'm gonna use that one for the uh, main focus of this video. Um, me, my wife, my wife was pregnant with our daughter at the time. Um, and <clears throat> I remember when I, uh, before we was, everybody was in the line. See, Dick Gregory was so humble and so, uh, so real, right? He, um, he, he let the people know. He said, look, I'm not leaving here. If people want a picture, I'm not leaving here till everybody gets a picture. Who wants a picture? I will wait for everybody. And so we all went out after the show was the show after the lecture was over. We all went out to like the little lobby part. It was a big, huge line, and um, it was a brother in front of me. And when I when we got up, it was close to our turn to um, taking a picture with him. The brother in front of me, his phone was uh, acting funny or something to that nature, and he was like, "Oh man, it's okay if I uh, if I use your phone to take the picture and you send it to me via um, Instagram or whatever or Facebook." I was like, "For sure, no problem, brother." And then um, we used my phone, took the picture, took a couple pictures, boom, I sent it to him. And ever since then, me and that brother, we've been real cool on social media with each other, man. So, salute. Um, but when it was my, me and my wife's turn to take a picture with Dick Gregory, you know, um, I went up. Um, I remember I said, God bless you. And um, in the picture, you see we're holding hands, like I'm, I'm embracing him. And um, he said, God bless you too, brother. He said, thank you, thank you. God bless you too. And um, the... The aura, just being in his presence, was like that close. You know what I mean? Was uh was very very um out of this world because uh it's so much history there, was so much knowledge there, so much wisdom, and um I'm I'm really thankful that I had that moment. You know what I mean? To uh, speak with Mr. Gregory and have him actually acknowledge me back and and, and him just be uh, a real down to earth, uh, cool individual. Uh, man. It was really breathtaking, to say the least. So, salute to the uh, Gregory family. Salute to his uh, wife. Salute to his children. Um, his nephew was there, too. His nephew was really funny, too, man. His nephew His nephew was actually playing in his comedy skit. His nephew plays the beat of uh, the Snoop Dogg C Murder, Mr. Magic. Don, 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 don. KLC made the beat. Boom, 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 boom. Was it KL? Uh, uh, uh. I think yeah, KLC. Yeah, KLC made that beat. Boom, 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 boom. He puts that in his um in his comedy skit. And it was really, really funny. You know what I mean? He was like, I'm not gonna get into all that, but salute. Peace out. That was when I met Dick Gregory.